Vity Day 14, take number five. <laughs> Usually I get this run off in one take, and tonight I just don't even like what I'm saying, and I think maybe I've got I'm in a bad state of mind tonight, maybe. So I'm, maybe I'm cranky, or everything's not coming out right. It's coming out as being kind of mean. <laughs> and I don't, I'm not mean. <laughs> Um, but anyway, if you're if you're linked with or following SSS Veda, today's topic is the news. And as I've said before, I don't watch it, don't listen to it, don't read it. If something major goes on in the world, I hear about it through social media, usually Twitter first, um, and uh, then Facebook. Um, and if I need to know more, I go to the news sources from other countries because our news sources are TV commercials. <laughs> They are there to tell you what to think about things, to withhold information that doesn't fit with their agenda, and to only offer you the information that will forward said agenda. So I have really no use for the information in our country, the information sources, the news stations, um, and they, um, I want news that tells me what happened, not what to think about it. It gives me the whole story, not only the part they think I should know to help shape my opinion. So I just don't, I just don't have anything to do with it. But like I said, I find out if something happens um, through social media, usually Twitter, and um, then I will go to news sources from Canada, from Australia, from Russia, that give me the whole story and don't tell me what to think about it. So um, the other reason I don't watch news is because I don't want my head and my heart anchored into this world. My head and my heart are set on my home, which is not earth. Um, not that I'm a Martian, but I know that my eternity lies with Jesus and I am promised uh, eternity in heaven with him. And um, the Bible is very clear that if you love, you know, if you love those who love the world aren't going to see heaven. And I don't really love the world. I, um, you know, I, I see many blessings. God has blessed me enormously. Um, I see things about it that I love. I see things about it that, you know, um, that he does. And, um, you know, there are people that I love. In fact, I can't think of anybody that I don't. Um, as God's love flows through me, there are unlovable people, but I always, he always helps me there just he and you know in my heart makes me feel love for anybody but um i just don't want to be anchored here i'm not anchored here i'm not anchored in the things of this world i'm anchored in my you know as i pass through as i visit as i'm an alien or whatever but um i'm anchored in the things of god in the things of the supernatural in the spiritual biblical spiritual sense and um that which is permanent and eternal as opposed to this world which is temporal so that is another reason i don't i don't watch the news um it just i don't care to be anchored here i don't care to know every little detail of what somebody thinks i should know um not that i'm not interested in um you know following following the um inevitable events that are going to lead to um the end of this world but, um, you know, um, I, I get it, like I say, through social media sources. And I've read the back of the book, and I know how it all ends. So, <laughs> so that is it for SSS Veda about the news today. In regular Veda, um, I have something on my mind, and this is take five, and I'm going to see if I can say it without sounding too disappointed or too hurt by it. Um, as I have been vlogging, I am finding that um, I wish that the people, my friends and my family would also vlog because I would love to be able to stay with, stay up to date with what's going on in their lives and, you know, see them and um, know how they're doing and, you know, whatever. I'm finding that my friends and family obviously don't feel the same way. Um, so it is a little hurtful that Part of the reason I do this is so that I can stay in touch with them and rather than watch take you know 10 minutes to watch this and it's not any one person obviously but rather than take even seven or eight minutes to watch what I say they'll take 15 minutes to type out an email and then uh, you know I don't know um, 
in my other vlog, I put a recipe up for a friend. She said, I don't, I'm not going to watch it. Or she said she couldn't watch it. I don't know why she wouldn't be able to watch it. But whatever, I don't disbelieve her. Um, but, you know, I did that for her. And then, you know, she wants me to write it out too. So I will write it out. Um, and I do answer my emails, although they're brief, because long emails, I'm lost by the third paragraph. I just can't wrap my head around, you know, paragraph after paragraph. I just can't do it. I used to be able to, um, but now I don't have the same brain I used to have. So, uh, but I do, you know, it's fine. I do answer the emails. It just puzzles me a little bit, and I will admit, yeah, it hurts me a little bit that I put this out there not only for YouTube and not only to make connections here, but so that my friends and family can stay tuned, attuned to my life a little bit if they choose to. And they do apparently choose to, just they uh, use other, they would rather use other means. So I do this and that. Um, so, you know, my, my time on the computer is, is fairly limited. I mean, I live a busy life. Who doesn't these days? Um, and so um, doing vlogs for people to see and then duplicating my efforts seems to me. I have to figure out what I'm going to do about that. I don't know. Um, but I am thankful for all the people I have found to follow and subscribe to here. Um, most of the people it seems are a lot younger than me and we don't have a whole lot in common but i really get a kick out of, of out of watching them and keeping up with them and i really get a kick out of them so um i do enjoy it and um you know sooner or later there will you know maybe i'll stumble upon somehow you know people who are like at my stage in life grandmother empty nest you know whatever husband retiring um and um so if you know of any, please let me know. Not that I don't want to subscribe to the younger people, because like I say, I, I love them. I get a kick out of them. They make me chuckle. Um, or, you know, they freshen my, my viewpoint about life because they're, they're, you know, 30 or more years younger than I am. They have, you know, a different point of view. And so it's kind of refreshing. Um, anyway. Um, I guess that's it for Veda Day 14, um, and I will see you tomorrow, Veda Day 15. I don't even know what the topic is yet, but I better look so that I can, so that I can study up, <laughs> be ready. Um, thanks for watching as always, and God bless, and have a wonderful day tomorrow. Bye-bye.